From a hidden Egyptian palace to the secrets of Leonardo da Vinci, here are 10 of the most amazing discoveries that shocked scientists. Number 10. Mysterious Chariot Pit A mysterious chariot pit has recently been unearthed in China, and it's shocking scientists across the world. The chariot pit is about 2,400 years old, and it was found by archaeologists in the central Chinese province of Henan. The pit contains the bodies of horses, chariots, and some other fascinating artifacts. The pit is actually part of a cluster of tombs that all belong to noble families from between 770 and 221 BC, near the modern city of Xinjiang. But the first reports claim that the tomb the animals were found in probably belonged to a mighty lord. About 90 horse skeletons have been dug out of the pit, as well as four chariots. However, the total number of horses buried here could exceed 100. According to the leader of the dig, Ma Jun Kai, from the Provincial Cultural Heritage and Archaeology Institute, the big mystery here is that the main tomb was already looted before archaeologists found it, and there have been no written records of who was buried in it or why. For this reason, it's currently impossible to identify the man so important that he was able to be buried with upwards of 100 horses. Archaeologists also say that the chariots were probably used by the mighty lord and his wife for daily commuting, and that he wanted to be buried with them. This is like the modern equivalent to being buried with your sports car. Number 9. The Holy Grail of Shipwrecks A few years ago, a robotic submarine discovered one of the most shocking shipwrecks ever. It was the San Jose, the treasure ships which became lost at sea over 300 years ago. It was carrying an extremely precious cargo of gold and jewels, but sank off the coast of Colombia before its cargo could ever be delivered. According to experts in the field, the submerged treasure still sitting on the bottom of the ocean is worth upwards of $17 billion. With this much money on the line, everyone's pretty eager to reach the Spanish galleon first. And even though its location was confirmed by the Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution, nobody's managed to recapture the gold just yet. There are a few issues, such as the different governments, mainly because Spain claims that the gold belongs to them. But this was a long time ago, and in any case, the politics are too complicated. The truly interesting part is that the ship loaded its cargo hold with riches from Peruvian mines and then left South America in 1708, intent on bringing its cargo back to Spain. In other words, the Spanish robbed Peru of their precious metals, and 300 years later, they're still trying to steal the gold back to Spain. This ship was sunk by four English warships, and today it's still sitting on the bottom of the ocean waiting for someone to reach it first. Number 8. The Hidden Palace of Ramesses II Archaeologists from New York have recently discovered a previously unknown Egyptian palace at the ancient site of Abydos. They're claiming the structure revealed during excavations could be the palace of Ramesses II. The ancient ruins of this city are about 300 miles 482 kilometers south from Cairo, deep in the desert west of the Nile. There are dozens of royal necropolises and temples here, several of which were dedicated to Osiris, the Egyptian god of the underworld. In fact, from between 2025 BC and 1700 BC, the city was the main spot of worship for the infamous cult of Osiris. There were chapels all over the city, a huge cemetery, and between 1279 and 1213, Ramesses II ruled over this legendary place. He's considered one of the most important rulers of ancient Egypt and is even known by the Greeks as Ozymandias, or Ramesses the Great. But here's why the Hidden Palace is so interesting. It turns out that Ramesses the Great spent so much time in the ancient city that he had his own palace built, which goes to show that Abydos was truly powerful 3,000 years ago. Scientists are shocked at the discovery because it was right in front of their eyes the whole time, connected to the previously known Temple of Ramesses II. Still, more research into the hieroglyphic markings need to be done in order to reveal the secret life of Ramesses the Great. Hey, before we continue, I just want to say thanks so much for checking out the channel. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like these. Number 7. An Ancient Human Jawbone Researchers in Israel have recently discovered an ancient human jawbone on the western slope of Mount Carmel that is rewriting what scientists understand about humans leaving Africa. This discovery has shocked scientists all over the world, as the jawbone belongs to one of the first members of the human species ever to depart the African continent. The jawbone was found in a giant cave near the coast of the Mediterranean Sea, where ancient people roasted turtles and ostrich eggs to survive. Alongside the ancient jaw, old stone tools were also discovered, and they've dated all these artifacts to between 174,000 and 194,000 years ago. This means that our actual ancestors left Africa at least 40,000 years earlier than previously thought by scientists. 
This discovery was published in the journal Science back in 2018, but was actually made in 2002 by students. Before this find, the oldest human bones found outside of Africa were discovered in Israel, though these ones only dated at maximum 120,000 years old. For a little bit of background, mainstream scientists believe that human beings existed in Africa about 300,000 years ago, meaning it took a very long time for us to wander off the continent into the Middle East, Arabia, and eventually China. Number 6. The Secrets of Da Vinci Some recent discoveries involving Leonardo da Vinci's famous artworks have shocked both the scientific and art community. Thanks to modern technology, infrared light has been used to show hidden drawings and alternative versions of sketches inside of some of Leonardo's most famous works. Scientists were actually able to essentially x-ray his drawings to show the original structures underneath, just like how an x-ray can see what lies beneath a person's skin. All this study has revealed that da Vinci sometimes created extremely simple works of art, then gradually built them up over time into the masterpieces we know today. The two most magnificent pieces of artwork discovered using this new technology are actually two completely blank sheets of paper that scientists found hold invisible studies for hands. Using high-energy fluorescence, analysts were able to see the drawings even though they had previously been invisible. The sheet is ordinarily blank, but with the fluorescence x-ray, diagrams of hands in different positions were revealed on the pages. These new pieces of art are being called studies of hands for the adoration of the Magi. Number 5. Shocking Secret Tunnel A secret tunnel has just been found about 30 miles 48 kilometers from Mexico City, and it's got archaeologists excited. It happened after a heavy rainstorm came down on the ruins of Teotihuacan, the most famous pyramid site in all of Mexico and one of the ancient capitals of the Aztec Empire. After the rainstorm, an archaeologist with Mexico's National Institute of Anthropology and History arrived at the pyramids to discover a massive sinkhole had opened up at the foot of the Temple of the Plumed Serpent. It was so big that the archaeologist was able to tie a length of rope around his waist and then descend into the darkness like Indiana Jones. As it turned out, this was a man-made tunnel leading into the heart of the Aztec Empire. Archaeologists got to work immediately trying to determine what exactly was under Teotihuacan. They had to use a giant ground-penetrating radar device manned by a team of 20 archaeologists to survey underneath the ground and make a digital map of the area. It turned out that this tunnel went 330 feet 101 meters from the center of the Temple of the Plumed Serpent to another end of the city. It had been sealed with large boulders 2,000 years ago as the Aztecs had wanted whatever was down there to stay lost forever. So far, archaeologists have uncovered at least 75,000 amazing artifacts from inside the tunnel, but they have yet to reach the core of it, and nobody knows what they'll find when they get to the heart of the temple. Number 4. The Dinosaur Mummy Dinosaur discoveries usually aren't enough to truly shock scientists, and yet the discovery of the Nautosaur was enough to shock the entire world. According to one of the researchers involved with this project, they didn't just discover a dinosaur skeleton, they discovered a dinosaur that looked just as it would have millions of years ago. Scientists are labeling the Nautosaur as the best preserved dinosaur specimen ever found on Earth, and it's currently the crown jewel at the Royal Tyrell Museum of Paleontology in Canada. Here's why the specimen is so legendary. When it comes to fossils, you can usually only see bones, but with this dino, you can't see the bones because they're still covered by skin and armor. Even 110 million years after the dinosaur's death, it's still in possession of its skin, muscle, and even its inside guts. This thing is being referred to as a dinosaur mummy because it was so well preserved. But what kind of dinosaur was it? The nautosaur was a huge herbivore completely covered in spiky armor that weighed around 3,000 pounds, 1,361 kilograms, and walked around like a living tank. In fact, it still weighs 2,500 pounds, 1,134 kilograms, even after all these years. The reason it's so perfectly preserved is probably because the dinosaur was swept away by a flood and carried out to sea, where it sank to the ocean floor and had its armor and skin taken over by minerals, which kept it completely trapped in time. It was so well preserved that scientists have already figured out what color its skin was. Number 3. The Jaguar Network a newly discovered tomb in the ancient Maya city of Copan, located in modern-day Honduras, is revealing shocking secrets. A young woman was discovered sitting cross-legged and surrounded by enormous animals. The woman's corpse was found with two deer, one crocodile, and a puma. Apparently, all these animals had been slaughtered as part of her burial ritual, and they've been sitting undisturbed since 435 AD. But here's where things get crazy. 
forget the girl and her burial. According to a paper published in September in the journal PLOS One, the puma may have been domesticated and it may have been the woman's pet. The study goes on to say that the Maya have been scheming to domesticate large cats throughout their empire, including jaguars and pumas. An archaeologist from George Mason University in Virginia says that evidence found in this ancient city's burial plots suggests big cats from Central America and South America were held captive and then traded throughout the kingdoms of Mesoamerica. Had the Maya prospered and not been conquered, we could all have pet jaguars right now instead of house cats. Number 2. Mummy DNA In a shocking first, mummy DNA has finally been sequenced by scientific researchers. The results of the tests shocked scientists and historians all over the world. According to the report from Live Science, the DNA of ancient Egyptian mummies is more closely related genetically to the people currently living in the eastern Mediterranean countries, like Lebanon, Israel, and even Iraq, than it is to the people living in modern-day Egypt. What this means is that the Egyptians who ruled the country thousands of years ago are no longer in the country of Egypt, and their bloodlines are now living in neighboring countries. This information is courtesy of the Population Genetics Group, with the DNA sequencing being done by a team of professional scientists from all over Europe and even Australia. DNA was taken from 151 mummified individuals, from their heads to be exact. The scientists then had to use a complex system of irradiated surfaces, ultraviolet radiation, and a whole lot of high-tech machinery before finally getting proper DNA from inside soft tissue and tooth pulp. They believe that the discrepancy between ancient Egyptian DNA and modern Egyptian DNA probably has something to do with increased trade along the Nile and the rise of slavery, bringing people in and out of the region in huge numbers that wouldn't have been seen until the last few thousand years. Number 1. 3,000 Skeletons in Central London 3,000 skeletons were recently discovered by construction workers in London. The scope of burial here was unheard of when it was discovered, especially since it was in a very busy major city. Work actually had to be stopped so that archaeologists could go in and excavate the remains, which they soon found out belonged to victims of the Great Plague of London. These bodies were found near the Liverpool Street Station, one of the busiest transport hubs in all of England. The bones were dug up and sent to be reburied at a cemetery in East London, but some of the skeletons will remain in laboratories to be studied by archaeologists and other scientists, as they're hoping that by dissecting ancient victims of a plague, they can better understand the evolution of the bacteria strain that caused massive devastation back in medieval times. As for the burial grounds where the 3,000 corpses were found, it was likely used between 1569 and 1738 and only used by people who could not afford to be properly buried by the church. The Great Plague of London, which killed about one-fourth of London's population in just 18 months, actually occurred after the Black Death of 1348. The Great Plague of London was the last major epidemic in England. This was between 1665 and 1666. With the influx of dead bodies that appeared during this time, it's no surprise there are so many random burials still hiding beneath the city streets. Which of these discoveries shocked you the most? Let me know your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more amazing videos right here on American Eye.